All right, guys, I just wanted to show you a couple different kind of tools that um, I've grew up with in my lifetime and stuff like that. So some of these are homemade, some were purchased, but most, again, are probably homemade. We were talking about a claw hammer before. Get this thing out of the way. These are three, well, at least two different kind of claw hammers with wooden uh, shafts, uh, definitely for any kind of construction, something like that. This is a homemade deal for sure. Uh, pushed in there, um, put in there with like a little uh, holder there. This would be more of a masonry uh, one as well, as we talked about how it has a big, heavy one-sided thing and then like a chipper on the other side so you can cut the bricks. And that's an old, old one for sure. You come across here, a couple of homemade mallets for sure. Um, this is really just supposed to be like a stump of a tree, probably a hickory tree or something like that with the homemade uh, handle on it as well. Right there. There's yet another um, masonry chisel, masonry hammer, again with a nice wood. This is a little more modern. You can tell by the way the handle is and it wasn't handmade. And this is a very long mallet. It is steel on the top. So it's almost like a steel uh, pipe or something that they may have forged together they did a very long handle on so it gets some momentum on that as well um but yeah that's a that's also a homemade deal for sure this one I'm not exactly sure what this is it almost like a it's almost like a railroad spike that goes to a point on one side it could have been used as like a, a, a homemade fashioned masonry hammer but um, again it has a super long handle on it so it's uh it's a little interesting that it's that long and I think that's about it for the hammers in here. Um, other than that, it's, you can keep watching the videos and then answer the questions at the end of the week. And I uh, hope you guys are staying safe and we'll see you hopefully pretty soon, guys. All right, I'm going to show you how to use a framing hammer. This is a framing hammer with a steel shaft. It's 22 ounce. Most are 16, 18 ounces, but this is a 22 ounce. I like it a little bit heavier, drives the nails in faster. So I'm going to show you how to uh, take out an easy nail out of a board and I'll show you how to do that. So these nails are old off of something that I had before. You can look down here. And um, so I'm going to use, some of them are bent, so I'm going to use the claw and just kind of bend them back so that they are a little bit more straight. I'm going to use it, like I said, I'm going to get close to this hard edge right here. And that goes in pretty easy just because it's a 22 ounce hammer and again, not like a 16 or an 18 or anything like that. This one looks like it might still bend a little bit, so I'm going to bump it out a little bit more. So another easy way, since I have a, a framing hammer with a straight claw and not a, a rounded or curved claw, I'm going to use a, a piece of wood and it'll make it a, a lot easier. So if I did it down here, it's a little harder because I don't have any leverage because my leverage is way out here. I really want it to be here. So it's a little harder. I got to kind of pull versus this way. I put a board underneath it. It just goes right out. Boom. Boom. All right. That's it. Uh, I will see you in the next lesson. Talk to you later. Bye.